with the theory that one can time travel within his own lifetime on a fixed income, I stepped into the Project Accelerator and vanished. <laughs> I found myself lost in time. I swear I wasn't sleeping. Seeing mirror images of another person. Driven by script writers. To change lives for the better. My holographic observer is Roxy. From my own time. Who is invisible to most people. Except little kids. Drunks. Mental patients. Animals and computers. I continue leaping from life to life, improving people's lives and hoping each time that my next leap will lead me to Dr. Sam Beckett. into this time. George W. Bush. Yes. Not so tough now, eh, Commander? Steve, stop! for the foundation of the United States. What do you have to say to that, Ms. O'Hare? Uh, O'Hare? Yes, you are Madeline O'Hare, aren't you? <laughs> was a woman again, but not just any woman. The 
currently late, great Madeline O'Hare, champion of atheist, non-religious rights extraordinaire. Well? No. What? In the Treaty of Tripoli, signed in 1797, starts, as the government of the United States is not, in any sense, founded on the Christian religion. So, you've decided to attack the Christian religion? No. What? I'm not attacking Christianity. I'm just stating a fact. The United States was not founded on Christianity. The Founding Fathers were Christians. Although many of them were deists, few were Christians. Heresy! Lighthouses are more useful than churches, Benjamin Franklin. He never said that! Thomas Jefferson, I do not find in Christianity one redeeming feature. You are provoking the wrath of God! Your God, of whom there is no evidence. Sorry, we're out of time. Well then, I guess we'll continue this discussion another time. How goes it? Aren't you going to flirt? With who? Me. You're killing the right. I'm a woman again. Just because I'm a lesbian doesn't mean I'll go for any woman I see. Just as attractive as that woman you're fawning over. Really? We are different in more ways than one. She's beautiful. Yes, she is. I'm talking about Madeline! She's currently 58 years of age, thus my failure to flirt with you. Sorry if you're disappointed. I'm not just surprised. I'm sorry too. <laughs> you're not here for Madeline, though. Madam O'Hare? Yes? Can I have your autograph? Who shall I make it out to? Good thinking! 
Emma Denningson. Emma Denningson is beaten to death by her father tomorrow night. Police suspect that alcohol was involved. Best wishes, Emma Dennings. Ms. Madeline O'Hare. There you go. Thank you, Miss O'Hare. Call me Madeline. You're famous. But I didn't know you were sweet, too. How do you think I became so famous? Sorry, I gotta go. Emma, wait! She's gone. Is she, uh... Yes, Emma is an atheist.